Okay, in case you missed it earlier, Hoda is a cover girl. Look at that right there. She is on one of the two covers for the April issue of one of our favorite magazines, Southern Living. It's a great magazine. Inside, you'll find the South's best list of small towns and cities in and Southern Living's lifestyle editor, Ivy Odom, is here to Hi, tell us Ivy. all about it. Hey, y'all. We're so happy that you're here visiting us. Um, I love how you spotlight certain cities that need a yeah. little spotlight because they've got be wonderful things there. Yes. And you're starting with? St. Augustine, Saint Augustine. Florida. It's your number one small small town, right? Yes. So this yeah. is our seventh annual South's Best Awards. Mm. And I'm so glad that St. Augustine made it to the top of our list because this is all reader submitted. So yeah. this is truly their favorite spots in the South. And St. Augustine, y'all, it's the oldest city in the South. Yeah. So it has ancient architecture and mm. it's really walkable, unspoiled mm. beaches and a really cool up and coming dining scene. I bet. How Have awesome. St. Augustine's close to Tampa, right? No. No, more it's north. The, yeah. No, I, no. I it's, it's awesome. But what are they, okay, so what do they have? So this is some honey from the Honey Truck Company, and it's all from a small spicy. scale beekeeper. This one's super spicy, so they have a pepper native. It's Not a little super. spicy. It's, it's good, but I dipped it with a it's a little spicy. It's spicy, yeah. yeah. Okay? Hot honey's yeah. all the rage. They have a pe pepper that's native to St. Augustine called the daddle pepper, and that's what's infused in that it's honey. It's delicious. So they also have lavender, vanilla, all of these. So many flavors. So Ben and Aaron put that yes. on the map in 2016. We want to give them a shout no, out. No, well, they, Ben and Aaron yeah. put Laurel, well, Mississippi right. on the map, which is this <laughs> similar because it's the second small town y'all yes. love. Laurel is one of our top 50 small towns. We love it because they put it on the map. Ben and Aaron are great. So they make... <laughs> <laughs> These wooden boards that are coming a variety oh, of beautiful oh, woods. Y'all, yeah. they're beautiful oh, and they're functional right. and they're it. durable. You can touch order them directly this is from their, their company. company. Yes, they're all American made. And they're beautiful, durable. I love that you can wash these and reuse the them, way, and it's yeah, like an investment. And Laurel, Mississippi out. is adorable. That's it a, is such a cute small town. I mean, it's affordable. It's beautiful. They have totally revitalized this city. Okay, right, shall we move next. on to our next small town, which I have a friend from, Thomasville, Georgia. Oh. Y'all, Thomasville is close to where I'm from, about 20 minutes from my city. Oh. I am so glad that this made it on the list. It beautiful. has a special piece mm. of my heart. So this is from the cheeses from Sweetgrass Dairy. Mm. They have a shop. Pimento. The mm. Downtown of Thomasville, y'all, is so cute. Is it? Yes, they have the original brick roads smack dab in the heart of the downtown where they're local shopping and food, and so you can walk into street, sweet grass and order their cheese I directly see. from mm -hmm. the dairy that's made in Good. Georgia. So I mean, all of this is so yummy. Chefs all over the all U.S. Right. feature these on their menu. Let's, it's delicious. Let's go big city, shall we? Okay, South yes. South Carolina. What's your number one? Charleston, of course, mm -hmm. is our number one. Everybody loves South's that. best city. So y'all have actually been wearing these necklaces. I've been spying them. These I are actually made, have one of these. You yes, uh -huh. they're made by Heart Jewelry mm -hmm. out of Charleston. And the coolest thing about these is everything is unique and custom made to order in their Charleston studio. Charms start yeah. at just $25. So you can make them really accent your personality, and so everything is unique to you. How I pretty. Love it. I like how you layer them. They're super cute. Yeah, yes. really so, cool. Okay, now, okay Jenna, this yeah, is let's for move you. on to my, my town. This is Dallas. So take a look at these. This is from Honey and Hank. So Honey Texas and Hank. If you look at these, you can see closely the outline of the state of Texas. So they oh, have cute. these hidden designs within each of their patterns, and they have them cute. for all 50 Dogs. states. Dog state outlines. They're all really unique and fun. And this is a women-owned and run company in Dallas. How cool. I love it. Now so shall we move it. on to Hoda's favorite? Come Hoda, on. come on, New Orleans. It's give me a praline. praline. I say pralines where we I'm say from. You say praline. Pra but in New, Down in in New, New Orleans. Orleans, it's pralines. It I is say pralines. Pra I say praline in Texas. I do too. But since These? it's for Hoda Hoda today. Let's, let's not worry about how we but say it. Let's no, just eat it. They're so good. Aunt Sally's, come on. Are these Creole yes, style. These, these are amazing. Mm. This has been a staple in mm. the city for mm. for a while. So it's, mm. they're great. So awesome. good, right? Oh my God. Really Please delicious. A second. By the way, you did a great job. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Your mother's in studio, which she is super is. cute. Nice I here. love it. I love that Sabrina's here and that you brought your family. Uh, thank you for coming to see us. Thank and you thanks for again me. for having me on your cover. I really, really appreciate We're it. Isn't to have she an excellent model? She is the <laughs> best cover girl I've ever seen. I agree.